of your dedication and leadership, you are hereby awarded this Leadership Achievement Award. Joy Arciane. Next award, Roy Tabera, Director in honor of this dedication and leadership. You are hereby awarded this Leadership Achievement Award. Roy Tabera, congratulations to you. Our next award is Susan Maranan, Director, Leadership Achievement Awards. Congratulations to you, Susan. Next award is Shirley Lumano, Director. Congratulations to you, Shirley. Nossa, director. Congratulations to you, Annabelle. Our next award is Attorney Roman Mosqueda. Mr. Antonio Roman Mosquera, congratulations to you. Next awardee, Bob Crowder. Bob Crowder, director. You have to run, Bob. <laughs> Where are we seeing you up here? <laughs> We're just kidding. Congratulations to you, Bob. James Dulles, our next awardee. James Dulles, director. He's not with us in the right moment. Thank you so much, everyone, and congratulations. Give our leaders another round of applause. Very few of the leaders were here 10 years ago. I know I was not there 10 years ago, except for Joe Arciaga, Leo Maranan, and Rick Rolda. I joined about seven years ago as a public relations officer. I just want to take this moment to do my concluding remarks, and then we can go back to dancing. Those of you who are really into dancing. Well, first of all, First of all, when we started this evening, it looked like it was going to be a long night. But you know what? One thing I realized is time flies. You agree? Yes. Time flies. In fact, in our lifetimes, 
Whatever age we're in right now, it's as if only yesterday we were 18 or we were 15, but we are here now, so time flies. You agree? And time will fly. We will all live, leave this room, we will all go elsewhere, but here is my challenge, ladies and gentlemen. You have seen a small organization, the Filipino-American business people, get together to try to make a difference in this world. And that's really what we are here about. We leave this room, what are we going to do to change this world and leave it a better place? Better than how we found it. Because we definitely came into this world better than how our, par our parents found it. Do you agree? Yeah. Right. And so let me just tell you, 10 years went by so fast in the blink of an eye, we're done. This evening, it's done. We're going to be dancing soon. And then after that, it's done. And tomorrow, we're back into our work and businesses again. How many people are looking forward to go back to their offices tomorrow? Some people don't even have an office to go to tomorrow. That's a wake-up call. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to thank all the people who came to share this with us. This is a fat birthday of sorts. But if you realize, we have been doing a few events. But the important thing is this. In October 2013, the Filipino American Chamber of Commerce Los Angeles is going to be hosting the Filipino American Chamber of Commerce Federation Convention. All of the North American Filipino American Chambers of Commerce on October 18, 2013. Save that date. They're all going to come here to the city of LA and we're going to have a grand national international Filipino American convention and this Chamber of Commerce is going to host it. Yeah. See that? We went to Portland, Oregon in August to press for LA to host this event. It's going to be here. We have the Philippine Chamber of Commerce and Industry joining us from the Republic of the Philippines and the different cities will be represented by the different Chambers of Commerce so two things can happen. You who are here tonight, who are not in business, may be in business then. And if so, come work with us. We can help you shorten the, the point to go there because it's, it's very difficult to reinvent the wheel. The second thing is, you can come and participate in 2013 either, as, either just as a, an audience or you would like to put your finger in the pie and be an active part of the Chamber of Commerce. How many people are in business here? How many are not in business? I challenge you. If you say you are not in business, you're wrong. If you're an employee, you are in business. Your employer goes out of business tomorrow, you're out of a job. So all of us are all in business. And I challenge you in 2013, be with us. Be a part of the growth, be a part of the culture. We thank you, and hopefully you'll be with us again 10 years from now when we celebrate our 20th anniversary. But in the meantime, it's a celebration. Once again, happy Thanksgiving Sunday to all of you. And let's have some dancing to celebrate the evening. Maestro, take it away. Thank you.